Hi everyone, Hayden from Little Green Alien. Today I'm going to show you how you can make something that looks like this look like this. It's not super hard, so let's get right into it. So for starters, you're going to need a green screen. And some other things you're going to need are, you're probably going to want a tripod. Uh, you want some lighting. I'm just using uh, some Pixar lamps. So, you know, not really too much money. And of course you need the object or person or whatever it is that you are filming. So I have Nemo. I'm doing a review on Nemo. It's actually going to be the last video that came out. So if you would actually like to check out the video that this is the behind the scenes for, there will be a link in the description, and it was just the video before this. So anyways, here are just the simple things I'm using to create this. And of course, you need a phone with a camera. You're also going to need two apps. I'm going to show you what those apps are. Also, another thing for the cheapskates out there, like myself... Uh, you can just use a TV as a green screen. All you have to do is just go on your Nintendo Switch or whatever game system or whatever thing you have hooked up to your TV that can play YouTube and just look up green screen. There's a 10-hour video and that's what I used for some of my green screen videos like the Finding Dory ending that I made. I used this. Now something nice about using a TV is there are no wrinkles in it so the wrinkles won't mess up your shot because sometimes they do. And, you know, you can just put your character up to it, and it'll work just fine. So, I definitely recommend trying that out. See which one you like better, the green screen or the TV. But if you don't own a green screen or anything that can be used as one, a TV works perfectly fine. So, thought I'd tell you that because that's something I have definitely used to help myself. You're going to need two apps. You're going to need Kind Master, and you're going to need Ucut. So start by opening UCut. So this might not make too much sense right now, but you just got to trust me. What you need to do is you need to add a one by one aspect ratio video in first. It doesn't matter what it is and then delete it. So what that's going to do is the video that you want. You have to use the video that you want to be the background in this. So the video that's going to be the background, you want it to have this border around it, and you'll see why pretty soon. And if for some reason you don't know if your video is a one-by-one -one video, or you just want to make your own so that you know it's right for the video, I'll show you how to make a one-by-one -one video right now in UCut. Alright, so if you don't have a one-by-one -one video or you're not sure or just whatever reason you want to make your own. How you do that is you go over to the crop option and you press the one by one right here. That looks like the little Instagram post. And then you have your one by one video. All right, so I'm about to start with Kind Master. This is the green screening app. So you want to make sure that you select this one by one resolution because that is the resolution of the video. So what you do now is you select your background. This is mine. And now you can see why we did the one by one thing. And the reason we did that is because if you look in the right corner, there's a watermark and I don't like watermarks. And you have to pay to get rid of it. And I don't really want to spend money. I'm kind of a cheapskate. So this watermark, it'll just go away because it goes on the border. And then you can just cut the video back down to 16 by 9 and it'll be as if it was never there. So that's why I do that. Anyways, you want to go to layer and then press media. Select the video that you want. And I'm going to make it. Just take up the whole screen. And then what you do is you go down to this chroma key option and you press enable. And it's not it's not always perfect when it starts, but if you just do some fine tuning, you should be able to find a pretty good point where it'll look good and there really won't be much green screen. The main goal is to get rid of as much green screen as possible.
And I think that looks pretty good. So that is how you do that. And I think it looks pretty good. So now I am going to save this video and I'm going to go back to U-Cut so we can do the final touch. So now go back to U-Cut and get the video that you just made. And then you go to crop and press the 16 by 9 YouTube option. Or at least that's what I would do. I guess just press whichever the original resolution of the video was. But for me, it's usually 16 by 9. And there you go. It is gone. There is no watermark and no border. So that's just a little little hack with using a kind master. And then also just make sure the video is cut properly. Like as you can see, Nemo goes away. And a point in the video, so just find a point where and make sure you don't cut off any audio. So I'm just gonna check that before I save it. All right, this should be good. And then just press save. After all that long, hard work, this is what you get. I think it looks pretty good. I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. I hope if you guys try this that yours turns out as good or better than mine. And I hope this helped a bunch of people. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing how I edit a video. I don't really know if I've ever done anything like this before. But I'll definitely do some more because I know that these types of videos would have definitely helped me when I was learning how to edit myself. So if any of you want to get into YouTube, like I am into YouTube and post a lot, I definitely recommend the app Ucut. It's my favorite editor. Unfortunately, it is only on Android. You cannot get it if you're an Apple user. I hope one day they get it to iPhone. I do own an Android but I would like to see you cut on iPhone so everyone can have it. Because I feel like most people own iPhones. Anyways, if you have an Android, you cut and KindMaster work pretty well. So I'd use them. I use them. I use KindMaster mainly for the green screen. You cut for everything else. So anyways, that's about it. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. Have a nice day.